All right, we finna leave my grandma's house before we leave. Wait, tell Auntie Lola to say hey to the vlog. <laughs> now that I got the camera out, you gotta say hey. She can't see you. Grandma, you can be allowed to They can't see. Okay, we'll see. You gotta say it again, because grandma was being loud. Oh, I said, what up? It's the number one fan, Auntie Lola. <laughs> <laughs> Grandma, what is you Ooh, doing? These she nice. over here trying on shoes. He's nice. Those, those is kind of nice. What is you wearing these shoes to? You don't even need one of my shoes. outfit. Shut up. She just be ordering <laughs> stuff. Anyways, I'm leaving my grandma's house. She didn't let y'all come to Chick Fil A or Stan's Donuts with us or Old Navy. So I'm sorry that y'all missed it, but she was confused anyway. It's okay, because when I do the Hawaii vlog, it's going to be lit. It's going to be lit. It's going to be so lit. Oh, and I'm going to make TikTok like we did when we was in Mexico. It's going to be oh, so much fun. Who we going to have so much fun, y'all. Let's get in the car. <laughs> All right, y'all. We just made it home. It's 627. I'm about to run Amina some bath water. And, oh, I am going to show y'all everything that we got when we was at the store. I was thinking about trying some stuff on. Well, I only got one thing. Everything else was for me to be. Why is you on top of mommy's table? No, mommy not laughing. Absolutely not, because I see what you're trying to do. Get, didn't I just tell you to get it? This be stuff I be talking about. Everybody want a kid until they do this. My baby knows she be into Miss oh. Rachel, okay? Oh. I just got a package. Ah! Don't you tear up this room because you're going to get a tub. You hear me? I know she heard me, but y'all just see her trip act like she ain't heard me. Can y'all guess what I got? I'm gonna unbox and show y'all. Let me get a stand. Okay, y'all. First, let me get some scissors. Scissors. I'm kind of linked over like this because I'm in pain. I'm in pain. And it's because, you know, the, the meds that I think I told y'all that I've been on. So we went to Target. Everything is on clearance, okay? Look at this cute little outfit I found for Hawaii yeah. for me. Ain't that cute? It's too little, but the vibes that we going for is like mini, cause it's Hawaii and we want it to be barely clothed, but clothed. So yes, Buki's gonna be so cute. Y'all, that was, I think $9 it was on clearance. Look at this cute little ah! And it's knit with the little booty shorts, y'all. Yes. I think this is five dollars. Then I got this little dress. Y'all. Five dollars. I got these little shoes, little sandals. Look at this other little mini. Okay, this gonna be like a little tube top. Little dookie booties. Ugh. Got her little swimsuit. Yes. This was a little expensive, y'all. It was eight dollars. Look at this skirt. Is this not cute? This was five dollars and sixty cent. I think I'm gonna take these back. But y'all, it was three dollars and fifty cent. Why not? So that's all of Bookie stuff. I think I know what this is. Oh yeah, this is my Skims package, y'all. Ooh, what y'all think I got? I got some bras. Um, I've never gotten any like real bras from them, so I hear really great things about them. And I get cut bras 
which are very expensive. Ooh, y'all. Ooh, this material. Y'all. Y'all, this material. Wait a minute. I'm gonna try these on for y'all. And I got a size 38 triple D. I think my back is a 38. I'm definitely a triple D. Okay, I'm really liking the mesh. I think this is the balconette. Yeah, this is the balconette. And y'all love, y'all know I love me a good online bra. That's why I be wearing the, I can't get it right here. The cut bras. Obsessed. And then this one is the, every, the fits everybody full coverage. Um, this is like a regular bra. I don't have bras like this, so. It's kind of got a light pattern. I don't like pattern bras. But we, I'm still gonna try this on to see what it's given. I think it's in the 38 triple D too. It is. So we're gonna see if these fit. So that was Skims. And then this one is Victoria's Secret. Y'all guess what I ordered from Victoria's Secret? Oh. Golly, y'all. Here, take some coupons. Yeah, cause you're doing too much. Okay, I got a little free bag. My purchase was like over a hundred and something dollars. Seven dollars, I don't know. That's a nice little bag, you know. I like to use these bags for when I'm traveling and I need a laundry bag. But, I got some gloves. That's pretty much the only thing I buy in the fall time from um Terry Secret because I'll be using my Terry Secret card and I try and use this twice a year. But y'all I got the like what you call this the platform uh, I didn't know if I should get the one without the little thing or the one with it. But I got it with it. I'm gonna try those on. See how they looking but that's what I got and now I got some gas so I'm gonna go sit on the toilet. All right, so it's a little bit later, 7.30, <clears throat> and Amina is in a tub. I'm gonna wash her hair and try and get everything together for tomorrow. Nothing on the agenda too much tomorrow. I am gonna go through and actually see what all I have to take to Hawaii and see what I can take back to the store because y'all, I do feel like I spent some unnecessary money today, so. I gotta get it together. But to be honest, y'all, I was just looking at my closet and I really think I got enough stuff. Amina has a doctor's appointment tomorrow for her eye. So I'm gonna give her her medicine. And I'm gonna see y'all in the bathroom. <laughs> Like damn, she and her move. 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 She lit, your money too. Like damn, she and her move. In the mirror, I'm doing my dance. Ain't you packing out nobody's pants? He a rapper, but don't got a chance. Sucking my waist, so I'm loving my bands. Like a million views in a day. There's so many ways to get paid. I tried dipping, he begged me to stay. Babe, I'm not staying, I just wanna play. In the party, he just wanna rump. Big boobs in the bus, they pump. She a baddie, she knows she a 10. She a baddie with her baddie friend. They like, I tell you, always stay hot. Oh, they mad cause I keep making bops. Oh, she mad cause I'm taking her spot. If I was bitches, I'd hate me a lot. Like damn, she in her mood. 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 She lit, get money too. Like damn, she in her mood. No friends, I don't fuck with the fake. Saying they love me, but one in my place. Step in the party, I'm looking the baddest. So the paparazzi in my face. Pretty bitch, but I came from the gutter. Said I'd be lit by the end of the summer. And I'm proud that I'm still getting bigger. Going viral is getting them sicker. Like what? Let's keep it a bug. Bitch, too boring, I'm stuck in a rut. Never get me wrong when I hop at the truck. Pretty bitch like Lauren with a big ass butt, yeah. Pretty face and a waist all gone. And I'm making them way hold on. And I'm making them way hold on. We hold on. Like damn, she and her move. 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 She lit, get money too. Like damn, she and her move. Like damn, she and her move. Like damn, she and her move. Like. Okay, so I got a minute off 
tub after I finish washing her hair. And now she is dressed, got her PJs on. I've started her hair. I decided to braid um, her edges instead of doing the rubber band method on those because it always looks like it's too tight. And it be getting those little, what you call it? I don't know what you call it, but you know like when it's real too tight. So I was like, instead of doing the rubber band method, I'm gonna just braid it, put oil on it. I'm just pull a bar it, but I'm gonna rubber band the rest. So, I know, I'm just gonna sit y'all up and probably do like a time lapse and y'all gonna see what hairstyle we come up with. Cause I never know. Also, she's watching Miss Rachel. That's her shiznit. I'm okay with it. Pop in, like a million views in a day. There's so many ways to get paid. I tried dipping, he begged me to stay. Babe, I'm not staying, I just wanna play. In the party, he just wanna run. Big boots in the bus, they pump. She a baddie, she knows she a 10. She a baddie with her baddie friend. They like I tell you, always stay hot. Oh, they mad cause I keep making bops. Oh, she mad cause I'm taking her spot. If I was bitches, I'd hate me a lot. Like damn, she in her mood. 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 She lit, get money too. Like damn, she in her mood. No friends, I don't fuck with the fake. Okay, so as you just saw, I kind of just been like doing like a straight to back pattern and then twisting at the bottom. I'm just going with whatever colors like I pick up. Nothing too extra. Um, like I said, the braids. This is how much we have left. And I'll just see you guys back when we're done. Okay. Boogie's hair is done. Ooh, her so pretty. Child, she just ready to look at We're going to put a little bar right there. Boogie's her pretty. She over it. I'm gonna put some oil in her scalp. This is um tea tree oil. Put a couple of drops. Child, your girl, huh? It be dry. That's our night. Say good night. We see you in the morning. <laughs> she over it. Good night. <sighs> Good morning, everybody. Today is Thursday, October 5th. It's 7.23 in the morning. I just got home from taking a minute of daycare. Um, it's raining outside. It's just like a really gloomy day. Today is going to be like my cleanup day, kind of like my reset since I go back to work tomorrow. Um but <clears throat> it's like still early i said my goal was to kind of get up and get moving by nine so i think i'm actually going to treat myself and lay down my stomach has still been cramping real bad and i don't know if it's cramps or if it's gas so yeah i've got that going on I am going to try on the skim stuff today for you guys. I am going to um, go through possible outfits. So I did not forget about that stuff. And I'm also going to wash today. I really want to like kind of do a deep clean, like sweep, mop. I might even try and clean my couch. Um, Yeah, so some cleaning is definitely needed today. Also, Amina has her doctor's appointment today for her eye. Um... I'm really hoping that we get some answers about this because it's just eating me up. I need to sit down and do some financial planning. Um, it will be really, really nice to work out today. Hopefully I can fill up to it, but it seems like in the evenings is when the pain kind of starts with my stomach. And I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I can't even do something as simple as trying to get in the shower. Like last night after I put him in the in tub and like did, did doing her hair was low key a struggle. Um, because I just felt, it just feels like this piercing gas. Like it really feels like a sharp pain, but I think that that's gas. So I don't know if I need to find me some gas X or something to like relieve me, but you know, I've been doing the bloom. 
in the morning um, to kind of help with like bloating. But to be honest, that's what it feels like. It feels like I'm gassy and really, really bloated. So I don't know. We need to deep clean Amina's room, mop, like all of that. Like I need to sweep, mop pretty much every room, move the couches, really get into it. Um, today's affirmation is I refuse to stress over things outside of my control. Y'all, that's the definition of me. <laughs> I am going to stress over things out of my control. I don't know why I'm like that. I don't know why I'm like that. I would love to sit down and start doing some editing. Don't think it's going to happen. But um, I also need to figure out if I'm going to get these braids touched up or if I'm gonna get a different hairstyle for Hawaii in two weeks because we leave on the 19th today is the fifth um yeah all right y'all so it is 10 o'clock a few hours later I know I said I was gonna get up at nine but I had like accidentally was awoken at like ate something and that just really threw your girl off so I feel like I deserve to late in the beat until 10 because I woke up at like 9 30 but um now I'm going to get started um cleaning and um kind of trying to prepare some of the stuff for the trip I decided I'm going to reach out to the Africans that did my braids and see how much they charge for a touch up. Because to be honest, I really don't think my braids is bad. I mean, don't get me wrong, it is bad. I done had them up since August. <laughs> um, but I feel like right now, if I could just get my first like two or three rows touched up, y'all see how it's looking. If I can get those first three rows touched up, I'm okay with that. And then once I get back, you know, maybe around Halloween, I'm focus on maybe a new hairstyle. Like it's gonna be fall, you know, I just went through a tough breakup. And usually during those times is when I try to, actually every time I have like a bad breakup, that's kind of when I try and reinvent myself. Sorry, my boobs are itching. Um, I try and, I could call it reinvent myself, but I like to try something new. And I've really been wanting to, get like color color like right now i just have highlights and i really been want to get tape ins you know just some type of like extension um try that out you know i love a good like fall winter um that's silk press season for me so the braids are about to be gone for probably about the next um four to six months because it's silk press season like i'm not gonna be sweating like that so your girl gonna be giving Hangaroo time. So the first thing we finna do is get the sheets off my bed um, and wash um, the sheets and the pillowcases and everything because I think I told y'all last week when Amina slept in the bed with me, somehow she scratched her nose and then she had like a little blood on my sheets. Ooh. So um, I'm gonna let y'all come with me to do that. This one that I have on is the full coverage 38G. I mean, 38 triple D. When I tell y'all, look, do y'all see 
first off, ignore my underarms. But the full, the full, you full coverage. What the girls? They are in place. I just wanted to get y'all like you know. About, they're in place, like. Yeah. Okay, so y'all see it. Yeah. Hold on, y'all, so I can figure out how much this bra was because I promise you I'm going to buy it in every color. Um, yeah, that bra was only $54. Run, run, don't walk, go get it, go get it. And in the cut bras, if you were wearing cut bras, like I told y'all, um, I was a 36 or 38 because mind y'all, I was pregnant and then I lost some weight, gained some weight. So I was a 36. F. Yes. But mind you, those are all unlined bras. And people been getting on me at my job because they be like, my nipples be, you know, nippling. I don't be caring because I just feel like y'all, stop acting like y'all ain't seen nipples before. But hold on, let me let me try on this other bra because now I'm going to go online and go order them in all the colors. <clears throat> all right, y'all. So now I have on the balconette bra. Y'all, this bra is so like smooth and buttery. First off, it's sheer, like mesh. And I thought like you were gonna be able to see, but you really can't even see. The only thing I will say is also I got this in a 38 triple D. I maybe should get a 36. I don't like how it looks. So I don't know what to call it, but like it looked far apart, like spaced out. But I think it's like, you see how even my straps look really far over? And I think that's because of the back size that I have. Because I also have it on the last strap. I like how thick these bands are. And they are really seamless. So I feel like I probably have to go down a size like a 36. Okay, so I'm back in the kitchen, which is the next room I need to clean because I cleaned my room, took everything off the dresser um obviously the sheets are in the washing machine then i wash the cup for their necks i swept all i have to do is mop which i'm gonna save mopping for last because i need to wash the mop here i'm in the kitchen now um i wanted to show y'all what it looks like before trash on the floor stuff needs to go out because what i'm actually gonna do is make breakfast eat and then clean the kitchen so I was trying to think like, oh, do y'all want to see me make breakfast? Um, but I'm just gonna make a bagel, sausage, scrambled eggs, and watch the Kardashians on my iPad while I do that. Um, and that's not really much to see. So, wait, part three of looping it. Wait a minute now. Y'all, part three of Lupin is on Netflix. Now they already done surprised me with um it's a new season of the Murdo Mur Murders, and I had watched that. Well, I ain't watched a new season, but that was a show that I had was watching. I'm trying to think of what else. Um, y'all, I didn't even know until a couple days ago that um Love is Blind done came back. Like what? Yeah, I gotta get back on top of my TV shows, y'all. So, yeah, it's Thursday, which means that it should be a new episode of the Kardashians. I think there should be a new episode of um, American Horror Story, too. So, that's probably what I'm gonna watch. Oh, they got a new Boogeyman on Hulu. I'm gonna probably watch that. Yep. Look, both of them. <coughs> gonna go watch my mama when I go. <coughs> it's a few minutes later. And I say that because I was watching, you know. I'm still watching. Anywho, I got my green juice. Donut. Okay, I'll be the trap. Bagel and sausage. I'm not even finna eat all this stuff. And I already took out my this line. Put them in here. I'm gonna go watch TV and eat. And then we're gonna clean. It's 11.03. So, gotta get back to it. 
Oh, y'all. It is 11.58. <clears throat> and I just finished cleaning the kitchen. Um, I did everything except for mop. Because I just put the mop head in the washing machine. But I sent it the door. <sighs> That's my work bag. That's when they go in the maintenance room. Ain't you no know the dustpan. Swept throughout the trash. Clean the refrigerator, clean the stove, clean the counters, clean the dishes, clean this table off. I'm actually gonna throw this away. Cause it's an extra cup holder for Amina's car seat that she clearly hasn't used in, I don't know, it's been like eight months that I've had that sitting right there. So yeah. Um, the next room that I'm about to clean is the kitchen. I'm literally just going from the back door to the front door. Here's my pile of trash from sweeping um, from the kitchen slash hallway. Um, so I'm gonna do the bathroom and then my closet. I'm not gonna lie y'all. I feel like I just need 15 minutes to sit down. Um, I feel like I shouldn't have ate like what i ate but i didn't even finish it like half i had two bagels two eggs two sausage i ate one and a half sausage one and a half bagel one egg so i'm upset with myself because essentially i wasted food but it is what it is um i think what i'm gonna do is try and clean the bathroom and then sit down for a little breaky break because i know my sheets are almost dry and i'm going to put those on the bed um and then that means the comforter will be able to go in the washing machine then i mean the washing machine will be free which means i can throw my load of laundry in there or i mean it really don't matter um while i clean the next portion and then i'll be able to finish up in the bedroom that should be like by the time i'm getting into the closet because i don't think it's gonna take long to clean the bathroom um because i really just cleaned the toilet and stuff a couple days ago i just need to clean the tub out the floor and like this little back piece the back of the wall clean that up there i think i want to get rid of this thing to hold her toys she really don't even use it Yeah, so I'll see you guys back in a sec. <sighs> What's going on, everybody? It is, I don't know, some time later. It's 1.25. Um, so, I took a break. <laughs> I took a 30-minute break. It probably was a little bit more than 30 minutes. It was probably like 40 minutes. A 40-minute break. Um, and sat down and watched American Horror Story. Because, <clears throat> like, I'm tired. I am and I just kind of keep working through my tiredness and I think that's the problem I never truly get a break but nevertheless um I just got finished mopping my room the kitchen and the bathroom the rug for the bathroom is in the dryer right now I'm cleaning out the washing machine and I'm gonna put a new load in but right now I'm sitting in my closet I'm sitting in my closet for two reasons first reason is I'm going to clean the closet and that just means like kind of get it back in order and reorganize there are some of these extra boxes and stuff that i just got away like i don't believe in hoarding it's funny because i was telling my ex that sounds crazy to me but i remember i was cleaning out his like closet room or you know extra room and he just had all these boxes and like stuff and i'm like what do you keep like what do you keep the boxes for i hate people who just keep boxes like what because it say gucci or because it say louis vuitton get rid of that shit what do you keep it's just adding just extra dust and, and space whatever and i don't know but i remember hearing that like when you keep boxes or i don't know if they said boxes uh, uh attract roaches it was something like this i don't keep boxes here are my Uggs. Remember I showed y'all these yesterday? I want to try them on. I don't care if you, your auntie, or your mama don't like them. <sighs> so since the fall is coming, what I usually do in general is I'll move like boots and switch them out with like sandals. So I still got heels up here and like 
that's up here flats these are all sandals it's time to switch out my fall and winter boots and put them up here which will be these two which i am still gonna order a regular um probably chestnut uh and a regular black uh um but yeah and i'm gonna get rid of these boxes because i don't do the box keeping i know for like the rest of this week it's supposed to be nice um but i'm just gonna still leave these sandals up here on top because these sandals i haven't even been wearing the stomach is stomach but <laughs> this is actually cute besides my the way my panties got this looking maybe it'll be motivation for me to like lose weight because right now with these meds i'm bloated and i look like it all right so this is another look that i'm bringing to hawaii not with these shoes but the crisscross top with this like wraparound skirt um i may consider looking for a different top but originally i bought this outfit for puerto rico and this was the look and i like it so yeah a little booty booty in you know i'm gonna get to the back i'm gonna hate bitches to the back he like him already he want the walk but i just want the fighting as much as i'm showing my coochie he's on the million you know Another bitch's man made my phone ring, hello? Every time he sell me, that's phone sex, hello? Mina, who's a big girl, Mina? Oh, no, don't take mommy's purse down. You want to hold it? Here, put it on. Ooh, look at that girl. That girl pretty. Yay. That girl pretty. Oh. Here. Okay, thank you. It's a little heavy. Ooh. That girl pretty. Mina, your hair so pretty. Oh. Oh. What is that? Oh. Oh. Blue. Yeah. Yeah. What about this one? see the attitude like what 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 sis basically we found out nothing at the doctor's appointment and i feel even more frustrated what i do know is it wasn't an allergic reaction because her allergy test came back negative to everything and it could be a bug bite it could just be irritation, but it's not the wing one. So, yeah. So, I'm in the car, just left the doctor. I'm maybe 20 minutes away, and Amina just threw up exorcist style all over herself. Look at this, all over my car. still like 30 minutes away from home and I'm on the expressway so I need to like pull over once I get to like a thicker part of the expressway try my best to clean up as much as I can this is mom life yo I am home um it's 6 56 I'm stressed out so I just got through taking like everything off her car seat so it's naked and I put it in the washing machine and then I clean my seats with like Dawn and Fabuloso clean the floors vacuumed it out I still gotta make dinner um now I'm gonna have to put her in a tub 
gotta finish washing. I'm not gonna lie, y'all, I'm stressed out. I don't even know how to put the stuff back on the car seat. I don't, I don't, I've never taken it off before. I didn't even know you could take it off, which is funny, cause I wanted to take it off to clean it before, and I didn't know how, so I gave up. But child, the way she threw up, I didn't have a choice but to figure it out. I gotta wash all her clothes. So, yeah. I'm finna call her dad because we need to talk. <laughs> Yo, it is 7.55. I'm stressed out. <clears throat> Since we last spoke, I did complete a load of laundry. I'm about to fold it. I put them in a tub. She in her room, clean. Don't smell like throw up no more. I ended up doing a barbecue chicken. Y'all know I really wanted me and Amina to make a pizza, but <clears throat> the time was terrible. And it's so late and I'm starting to get this migraine because I haven't ate since breakfast. So I'm over here making ramen noodles. And then I had some old, not old, but I had made earlier this week some um, steak, um, some sir steak or whatever. So I guess that's what I'm finna eat. Even though I really want this barbecue chicken, but I know that's gonna be like at least another hour because you know, I gotta cook all my food to fall off the bone. Y'all wanna see it though? Mm. Yeah, that's gonna be five five. But you know, I gotta cook all my food to fall off the bone because I can't bite it, bite into it. Um, so yeah, I decided that tomorrow for work, I'm just gonna take a half a bagel and um, I'm only gonna make one sausage and one egg. Which, speaking of which, let me take the sausages out. Oh, or y'all know what, I don't even have to do sausages. I forgot that I got um, smoked salmon. So, I will have that smoked salmon with the egg and the bagel. Um. I'm about to start folding. I already packed up Amina's breakfast. And this some rice. I think I'm gonna add her some chicken in there for her um, dinner. Um, but I found me a little movie to watch on Hulu. Um, I still ain't been able to get in touch with Amina's daddy. I called him a couple times, but it's honestly whatever. I can't wait though for that to dry, which it should be drying like 15 minutes. So I can figure out how to put that shit back together. Cause that I have to do before I go to bed. Like it is a must before I go to bed. But I'm gonna be chilling y'all. Finna fold and put up these clothes while I cook this chicken. Yeah, I'm probably just gonna make some rice and I think some spinach. Um, and call it one because that's a wrap y'all Tells me that was too easy. It was too easy. Can't even make my sense. Something ain't right. But to be honest, I don't care. What I need to do before I turn on the camera is know what day it is and 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 what month and all of that type of stuff. Cause y'all, it's ridiculous that I don't be knowing. And I be coming from work in which I have to look at the day all day. But anywho, happy Friday. 
y'all know it's a new week which means i got a new set of invisalign in which means i'm talking different than i was last week slash yesterday but it don't matter because my teeth gonna be straight that's all that matter that's all that what oh i thought somebody hating in the background was saying something anywho <sighs> y'all see my teeth Sean done because I roll up as we because I got it going on. I can hear that in somebody else's car. But no, um, y'all look at this trap. I ain't never seen traffic like this. Um, I'm on my way to go pick up Mina Bean from daycare. Um, just got off work. You know, work was working or whatever. It was doing what it was doing. Y'all, okay, first off, let me put y'all on, but then it's over already. But y'all be watching Lupin or Lupone on Netflix um because i do and i just finished it i know what y'all think because i just started it last night when i didn't talk to y'all and actually i started okay i watched an episode last night and then i finished the rest of the episodes today at work um hold on y'all the daycare is texting me they said i mean a little diaper rash it's the same no words she seemed tired today she did not go back to sleep this morning but later in the day she was really tired oh like the Super Bowl, man. Y'all, I did not know Monday was Columbus Day. And my baby ain't got no daycare. Say hey, Buki. Hey. Oh, that pretty girl. You said hi. Why you be staring like that, though? Okay, never mind. But y'all saw she said, hey. Wow, that was so nice. She's such a glorious person. Um, We got Bookies. Um, I'm a little bit hungry. Did I tell you that Mom, I made barbecue chicken? Yeah. Huh, baby? <coughs> oh, what'd you talk about? This For that car right there, driving crazy. Like they don't see your mama on the road. Huh? Car? 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 She a real Chicagoan. She said car already. All right, y'all. So I have dropped off Amina right now I am just dropped off some money to my kind of like my little handyman a little bit not like the Mexican handyman but he be like cutting the grass and stuff like that and everything but what I wanted to come and tell y'all was so it's six o'clock right and I'm starting to feel like the tightness and like the crampiness in my stomach and I mean it's terrible like now granted i have not drank any water i really ain't ate since lunchtime and all i have was little green beans and some man y'all that barbecue chicken was off the chain that barbecue chicken was so good i'm definitely gonna go home and eat some but i ain't gonna lie i don't really feel like eating i don't i don't feel like eating but i'm finna head to my building check the mail um yeah, just take a look, see around because it's been a little minute, so let's go. I'm home. I look kind of cute, but um, I'm home. Every time I come home, um, after I've dropped off Amina, I low key. I'm trying to get this to sit up right. I be so sad, y'all which is so funny because I'll be talking about I need a break, I need a break. And then when I get it, I'd be so sad. And I think what would be sad is realizing that it's just me. Like without her, it is just me. And I miss my bookies. Don't get me wrong, I love my bookies. Love her down. And I do be needing some time alone. But how I miss her. I really wanted to make a pizza since I bought that crust um, and stuff. But I'm a little upset with myself because the cheese was in the freezer. Guess what, y'all? Okay, first I'm in my robe, my cozy robe. Second, the cheese thawed out, y'all. So I made a pizza. Is it lame though? Like, I know y'all tired of hearing about me in this situation, but like, 
I remember <laughs> a time when I was making a pizza with someone else. And I just made pizza by myself. I really wanted to um, make a pizza with Amina. But, you know, she's at her dad's. And I really wanted this pizza. And I just really wanted something kind of quick. And y'all, this only took 10 minutes. Well, it probably took 10 minutes to, like, prepare. But then it only took 10 minutes to cook. So, yeah. But... I'm excited to eat it. Um, I am feeling a little lonely, but I can say that I feel a lot better this week than I have in the last few weeks. And um, I'm getting back used to myself and like, you know, doing things for me and putting myself first and like all of that great stuff and um obviously it's always nice to have like a companion to have somebody else you know to be there to hold you to talk to at night or you know to lay with and snuggle or you know just somebody to check on you in the middle of the day or whatever the case may be but i also know that it's a nice feeling to not have to worry about someone not answering your calls not returning your text messages um even though i tend to romanticize the really great moments and completely drown out um a lot of the like bad stuff um, i'm getting better at still being like hey but that bad stuff was happening and no matter how much i want to romanticize romanticize the wonderful stuff i have to live in reality so i'm gonna cut up my pizza and i'm gonna eat my pizza and watch love is blind and um i don't know i'm even thinking about having me some wine but i don't know i don't think i can drink on this these meds and i've already been having terrible terrible um like side effects